Hello, my name is Matt Otterbein. I'm with General RV Center. Today we're here to talk about safely connecting and disconnecting your fifth wheel hitch. Before we hook the truck to the fifth wheel, we want to properly inspect the fifth wheel hitch to make sure it's safely operating, the jaws are not sticking, and the hitch is safely installed in the truck per the manufacturer's specifications. This hitch looks like it's ready to go, so we're going to go ahead and get it hooked up. A few things we need to look at before we actually back the truck up to the fifth wheels. One, to make sure that we chalk the tires on the fifth wheel. Two, we want to make sure we have the proper height of the fifth wheel so the truck will clear the bed rails and also our pin height is correct. If you're coming in at an angle, you're going to want to make sure you put your tailgate up because it can damage the front of your fifth wheel. We're also going to make sure the handle is in the proper position for hookup and our pin alignment is correct. So now we're going to go ahead and get this hooked up. Now that we have the fifth wheel locked to the hitch, we always want to make sure and look inside to make sure the jaws close around the pin. Also we're going to come up, make sure we put our safety on the lock, pin through, and then make sure that we have our emergency breakaway hooked up. We're going to plug in the cord for the lights and the brakes, raise our tailgate, and now we can go ahead and raise the legs up, put the weight on the truck, remove our wheel chocks, and we're ready to go. We're now going to go over how to properly disconnect your fifth wheel from the truck. When you're ready to disconnect, you want to make sure you run your main leg down. My rule of thumb is halfway down between the ground and the bottom of the fifth wheel before we lure this leg. Once you have the leg lowered, we can go ahead and start to extend the jacks. What I like to watch for to make sure that we have the weight off the truck is to make sure the bed rails, when they're coming up, when they stop, also when the pin box and the hitch start to separate. We're going to want to make sure we chalk the tires before we release the hitch, and then we can pull the pin and the lock and pull the handle out. We're going to disconnect the breakaway switch. We're going to lower our tailgate and unplug the wiring harness. Now we're ready to pull the truck away from the fifth wheel. So now that we know how to safely connect and disconnect your fifth wheel hitch in your truck, we need to discuss the different st style of hitches. There are slider hitches that you can use in your short bed pickups or a standard hitch like we have here. The slider hitch is coming manual sliders or you can get an automatic slider also. Also you want to make sure that you pick or get the correct weight hitch for the fifth wheel you're pulling. Now that we're talking about weights, we want to make sure you have the correct tow vehicle for the fifth wheel, fifth wheel you're pulling also. When you go into General RV, our experts there can help you with all of that. For more information on anything you have seen in this video, feel free to stop in at any one of our General RV Supercenters or visit us on the web at www.generalrv.com or feel free to give us a call at 888-436-7578. My name is Matt Otterbein. Thank you for watching and happy camping.